I guess the best way to ask it is, could you share some of us your initial concerns and hesitations, kind of that gut feelings that you might have been having whenever you were considering a virtual assistant? And, you know, pre Rose, appreciate it. Close your ears. I don't want you to think there's any concerns about you. You're fantastic. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So I'd be happy to comment on that. So, um, you know, I had, I've heard of virtual assistants for some time and it had kind of been on the back of my mind, you know, over the years. Um, but then of course I, I mentioned the circumstance where it started to make me think a little bit more seriously. Uh, but my concern had all along had been the privacy and security aspects. Um, as you know, many virtual assistant companies have virtual assistants working from home. And I would just never was quite comfortable with that arrangement from a privacy and security standpoint. So then when I came to learn you know, about the BBC Global approach with the work being done in a centralized office where there are managers on site, that you know, the internet, the hardware, the software, all of that is arranged by the company and when the company provides oversight and just all the things that are done to be a HIPAA compliant partner, that's really when I started to take the idea of getting a virtual assistant much more seriously because that, you know, what. BBC Global does on that in that regard really address that concern for me. So I work for BBC Global, so I know all about our HIPAA compliance. In fact, we did a whole webinar on our HIPAA compliant aspect. What kind of things did you do to uncover to ensure that we were HIPAA compliant for you? Like, what were you looking at? Yeah, well, for one, the work being done in an office is you know fantastic because it's secure. The the hardware is controlled, the software is not an individual acquiring those things, you know, per some checklist. Um, so that was great. All, all of the, the firewall, et cetera. I think you're, I did watch the HIPAA webinar. I think they did a great job of really covering all of that, but even all the way to, from the fact that, you know, uh, anyone who works there, you know, their phones, for example, are, you know, put away, you know, from top to bottom, just everything's done the right way. And, um, and so that, you know, when I learned about all of those things, I really, I could tell that the approach, you know, that, that the company was taking, taking was really in line with the kind of security and privacy that I would want. So, so that's really what resonated well with me. Awesome. Awesome. So, all right. So you had some initial concerns about HIPAA, then you kind of checked into what our process was and kind of verified what we did that was, that kind of made us HIPAA compliant. Um, and that was important. It also, there were some concerns initially. Um, it, it sounds like just about whether VA was going to be able to do the job or not. And then, so then you go through the process and you start talking with BBC Global Services, trying to make your decision. What ultimately led you to make the decision to have a B VA? Well, I think um, you know the the privacy security thing was probably definitely the biggest uh, the biggest thing. And you know, once I felt like that was addressed, I think the major barrier was kind of lifted there in terms of me moving forward, um, but just kind of taking a step back and look at it more broadly, something that just kind of tipped in favor, you know, of course, you know, it's a very cost-effective solution, but it's also one that, you know, something that we may not readily think about is we're getting really great quality, um, uh, great quality service, you know, Rose is fantastic, she does so much, and at the same time, there's not any hard resources that I have to worry about supplying, even from something as the space itself here in my office to computer, phone, et cetera, you know, it really was a big benefit that all of that was is taken care of and provided for by BBC Global. But again, from my perspective, the fact that Rose is in an office doing the work is, you know, was very valuable for me. That's fantastic. Yeah, I mean, and that's really what we strive to be and do. Um, and 